Today, I'm going to be tuning the brand new Zeus Evo. I need to show you guys the engine swap, suspension chain, and the gearbox configuration. For the engine swap, leave it stock. And for the chassis, I recommend you guys to leave it stock since it's under 2,500 pounds. For the suspension chain, I recommend you guys to pause the video. And for the gearbox configuration, I recommend you guys to buy the 6 speed on this car and be doing a handling test, top speed test, and drag test. Alright, so we're at the handling test area. Let's see how well this car can do. Alright, so you could get a possible 55 seconds to 56 seconds. Alright, on to the next test, which is top speed. Alright, so we're at the top speed test area. Let's see how well this car can do. Alright, so you get a possible 49 seconds to 50 seconds. Alright, on to the final test, which is drag. Alright, so we're at the drag test area. Let's see how well this car can do. Alright, so you get a possible 10.4 to 10.5. In my opinion, the Zeus Evo overall, it's a meta car. The top speed, it's meta. The overall acceleration, it's meta. The overall brakes, it's good. How are the handling? It's surprisingly good, but if you turn too hard, it will slide. Well, is the Zeus Evo worth it? Well, if you're looking for a good all-rounder, the Zeus Evo is a pretty good choice. However, its auction price and Robux price really holds back, and it could cause some of you guys to avoid buying this car. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no. Anyways, that will end the video. Make sure to subscribe for more driver content and separate videos coming out soon. Alright, see you guys next time.